Hello everyone, um, welcome to a quick video on how to flash code from your coding environment to microbit. So to begin, I'm just going to give my uh, project that I've created a quick title. It's uh, the heart information. I made a little program here that shows a beating heart. I'm basically looping this forever that I show the one heart, pause, and show another heart, pause. And so it basically makes it look like a beating heart. So when I get this to show up on my micro bit, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on download. Different from a Chromebook, what happens is it saves this to uh, your computer. So you have to move it from your computer to the micro bit. So once this message pops up, you can click done. Down here at the bottom of your screen, there's a little fly up menu, and I click the arrow right down here at the bottom. The arrow gives me some options. I like to go to actually show in folder. Students will commonly click on open. I actually want to just show in folder. This is going to show you where on your computer that this file has been saved. So it's kind of an easy way to locate the file and be able to easily move it over into the micro bit. Give the computer a second, and there it is right there. It even highlights it for me. So micro bit heart animation dot hex. So perfect. That's my file that I want to be uploading it to. I need to send this file over here to my micro bit on the E drive right here. So what you do is I tell students to drag and drop the code from here, and I just drag it over. You can see it. you get a little copy to the micro bit. It gives you a prompt that says copying. When I look at my micro bit, I'm seeing a flashing light on the micro bit itself. And then now it's done. And when I look at my micro bit, I can now see a beating heart on my micro bit. So if you can't see that, you're just going to have to take my word for it. That's how you flash code from your coding environment to the micro bit. I hope this video has been helpful and take care.